Kwe Medaolen, Nindelewisi Art Stevens. Hi, how are you? My name is Arthur Stevens. I work as the manager of Indigenous students with the Faculty of Agriculture here at the Dalhousie Truro campus. I'd like to start this by acknowledging that Dalhousie University is located in Mi'kmaq, the ancestral and unceded territory of the Mi'kmaq. We are all treaty people. I'll start with a little bit about myself. So I have First Nations status in Canada, and I'm a registered band member of the Millbrook First Nations, which is one of 13 First Nation communities in Nova Scotia, and just happens to be in close proximity to the agricultural campus. I'm actually an alumni of the Faculty of Agriculture, having graduated in 2010 with a Bachelor of Science in Animal Science. It's something I'm really proud of and that I like to share with everyone that I speak to about opportunities that are available to them as an Indigenous person at Dalhousie. My primary role with Dalhousie Faculty of Agriculture is to support those students who identify as Indigenous throughout their student experience. That's from recruitment all the way to graduation and everything in between. So how do I support you on your educational journey here at the Faculty of Agriculture? Well, I actually do that in several ways. Primarily, again, I'm here to act as an advocate, a liaison, um, advisor, um, you know, again, having uh, done my undergraduate in animal science here, I've taken a lot of the classes um, and worked with a lot of professors that you'll be working with. So I already have a good understanding of the uh, experience and I'm definitely ready and able to help you, uh, guide you through it. Uh, navigating university or post-secondary in general can be challenging. Uh, oftentimes it's your first time away from your community um, and your uh, family. And so uh, having a person who um, is from a community similar to yours and has worked through an experience that you're currently going through uh, can be an asset. And I hope to be that for you. Faculty of Agriculture and Dalhousie as a whole has really worked to um, make the campus and the institution uh, as a whole more inclusive and more welcoming to our Indigenous students. And, you know, this can be seen in various ways throughout our campuses. This campus in particular has taken the initiative to rename a main roadway throughout the campus from River Road to the Indigenous Mi'kmaq word of Cebu for River, or Cebu Aote for Cebu uh, River Road, um, as well as installing permanent, uh, permanently on campus um, the Mi'kmaq Grand Council flag. And um, we have a student learning commons um, that is new to the campus just above our McRae Library. Uh, in there, there is a mural um, that uh, acknowledges our traditional territories and lands. Uh, uh, so really becoming a more uh, welcoming uh, environment where our Indigenous students can see their culture uh, clearly reflected within the institution uh, and know that they are welcome as part of this community. The Faculty of Agriculture is excited to share that we now have a Indigenous Student Access Pathway program. So this program uh, is a one-year program exclusively for those who identify as First Nations, Métis, and Inuit. Uh, it provides a foundational uh, coursework, dedicated uh, supports, uh, and uh, is set up for Indigenous students who would not otherwise be eligible for admissions under Dalhousie's current minimum uh, prerequisite, uh, high school prerequisite. So it gives students the opportunity to start their university experience uh, in a supportive uh, environment uh, with an, uh, an academic design uh, to meet their uh, unique needs. So ISAP um, really looks to engage students both uh, academically and culturally. Throughout the student experience, uh, there'll be opportunities for our Indigenous students to get involved with local Indigenous communities. Um, we have an elder in residence program where they can access an elder for, for counseling or um, uh, teachings. Um, it also has a strong and supportive network of faculty and staff who, who really are interested uh, and invested in seeing our Indigenous students succeed, um, uh, both academically uh, and socially within uh, the Dalhousie community. So the program uh, is set up as a two-semester, one-year uh, program. The course load uh, is about uh, eight courses. Um, of which uh, six, a minimum 
or sorry, maximum of six can be credit bearing. Uh, and that's with two courses that are upgrading. So in effect, um, instead of sending a student away to uh, upgrade to meet those um, prereq requirements for admissions, um, the student uh, is enrolled here as a full-time student, takes the upgrading while they're registered as a full-time student, um, but also uh, is enrolled in first year uh, university credit bearing courses. So they can hit the round running uh, if they successfully complete the program uh, effectively in their second year uh, and ideally in their degree of choice. But at a minimum, um, they'll be eligible and enrolled uh, in a Bachelor of Arts at Dalhousie University. Eligibility um, for the ISAP program provides uh, for a couple things. Number one, you need proof of uh, Aboriginal or Indigenous ancestry. Uh, you need to have a present and valid high school diploma. Um, and you also have to submit a uh, statement uh, of intent or a letter describing your educational goals and your commitment to the ISAP program. And that's it. Uh, the applications will be reviewed by a uh, committee of um, Indigenous uh, scholars, uh, myself, and the Registrar's Office. Uh, and the successful candidates um, will be up and running um, uh, in the fall intake. So if you're looking for more information about what it would be like to be an Indigenous student at the Faculty of Agriculture or Dalhousie as a whole, Please don't hesitate to reach out. My email is arthur.stevens at dal.ca and my other coordinates can be found on our Indigenous page which is acindigenous at dal.ca. I look forward to hearing from you.